What's up, guys? It's Full Fox Fifty Six. Back here with another video. You guys love the AFC predictions for this year, so today we're back. But today we're doing the NFC. We're starting with the NFC, and we're going to be doing the NFC East. Now, if you haven't already, go down there and hit that like button. And also, if you haven't already, go down there and hit that subscribe button and turn on those post notifications. We are on the road to 37,000. I need all you have to get there. But enough talking for me. Let's get, get straight into the video, starting with the first team, which is the Philadelphia Eagles. Warning, as with all of these videos, this is my opinion. I will not be biased, and you do not have to agree with me in any sort of way. Now, I feel like the Eagles are going to go 9-7, and seven, and here are my two reasons why. Number one, for offense, Carson West is back from injury. And even if he gets injured, they do have a backup in Jalen Hurts. Number two, on defense, it's really starting to come together. They did have a questionable decision with Jalen Hurts, obviously, because they're at Carson Wentz. But I think it was really smart because they now have a backup in case Carson Wentz gets hurt. And also, Jalen Rigor. Yeah, that was, I, I honestly agree that that was a pretty dumb decision when they did have Justin Jefferson right in front of their eyes and they didn't take him. But other than that, let's move on to the next team, which is the Dallas Cowboys. Now, I feel like the Cowboys just like the Eagles are going to go 9-7. and seven. And here are my two reasonings why. Number one, they did pick up C.D. Lamb, and that just makes their offense that much more explosive. And as Scooter Magruder said, Don't let this be Randy Moss 2.0. Like Scooter Magruder just said, I'll put the video link in the description, he said, don't let this be Randy Moss 2.0, but Jerry Jones was smart, and he didn't let that chance slip away to get C.D. Lamb. And now they have easily the best receiving core in the AFC East. I mean, not the AFC East, NFC East. Sorry, I just slipped up. But anyways, let's move on to the next team, which is the New York Giants. Now, I feel like the New York Giants are going to go 2-14, and 14, but they're not going to be the worst team in the division. And here are my two reasons why. Number one, on offense, Daniel Jones was okay, but okay at best. And number two, their defense is atrocious. I don't even know if I have to say anything other than that. Anyways, let's move on to the last team, which is the Washington Redskins. Now, do you think that I need to explain why the Washington Redskins are going to go 1-15? Please, no! 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 I didn't think so. But anyways, let me know what you thought of my rankings in the comments. And as always, I'll see you in my next video. Bye!